Well, while the Division I teams get set for their conference tournaments, in Division III, the NCAA tournament field almost set. The state of Wisconsin going to be well represented. UW Oshkosh, as well as St. Norbert, have clinched automatic bids into the women's tournament. Well, take a breath here. There's a lot of them. Marion. UW Stevens Point, St. Norbert all have automatic bids on the men's side. The bracket's going to be unveiled Monday morning. Our Jude Wilberts has more on St. Norbert's prospects heading into the tourney. St. Norbert was all smiles Saturday, securing their fourth trip to the NCAA tournament in the past five seasons with a win over Grinnell in the Midwest Conference title game. You don't want to leave it to chance and have a guy sit behind a desk crunching the numbers. This erases all doubt. This team deserves to be in. They paid the price all year. Very happy for the seniors. The Green Knights carry an impressive resume into the tournament. 24-1 overall record, 18-0 in conference, 22 consecutive wins, and a number five ranking by D3Hoops.com. Pat Coleman, executive director of D3Hoops.com, watched the Midwest Conference Tournament and left impressed. They passed my eyeball test. They looked to me like some of the teams that I've seen in other parts of the country who have been, you know, into the round of 16 to the round of eight. You know, they may not be able to get to the round of 16 or round of eight, but they definitely have that talent. Coleman explained that while the D3 Hoops voters see the Knights as a top five team nationally, the NCAA seeding process is based on a list of 15 criteria along with a regional advisory committee, making matters worse. Having UW Stevens Point and UW Whitewater geographically close hurts the Green Knights' chances of hosting the opening rounds. This is a bracket that's not going to be too geographically diverse. The NCAA at the Division III level is more about saving money than flying teams around and getting the most equitable matchups. The Green Knights understand the way this process works. You know, obviously we would like that because we, we play well at home. Um, we have the, the crowd that shows up and, and really has our back. Either way, we're going to have to beat some good teams if, if we want to make it to where we want to go. This place is awesome. You saw it today. It was rocking. If we had an NCAA tournament game, I think it would even turn it up another notch. I think it would be awesome. The Green Knights have done all they can on the court. Now they just have to sit and wait. In the Jude Wolves, Fox 11 Sports.